contents of this video are neither produced nor endorsed by Cubify, 3D Systems, or EchoCycle. The first step to unjamming your EchoCycle 3D printer filament cartridge is to remove the jam cartridge from the printer. This can be done from the settings menu on the machine. Next, remove the top cover of the cartridge by unclipping the outer latches inside the cartridge. Then, remove the top by unlatching the inner clips. This may hurt your hands, and it might sound like the cartridge clips are breaking. This is normal. Once you've removed the top, unroll the filament spool slightly so you can pull back the plastic sheath to expose a segment of filament. Now reinstall the filament cartridge with the top removed. Start a print where the material that was jammed is used. For example, if your black filament cartridge is jammed, start a print which uses the black filament. Before the print begins, hold this plastic piece in the two teeth that slide into the slot. Hold this piece against the cartridge edge for the duration of the unjamming process. When the print begins, grab the exposed filament and push it upwards into the feeding mechanism. Pushing the material will hopefully clear the jam, which most likely was caused by the feeding mechanism not being able to pull the filament through. This process may fix the problem after one try or many. As you'll see, I eventually use two hands to push the material. This is where it might be useful to have two people, as one can push the filament through the mechanism while the other holds the plastic piece on top. Eventually, the feeding mechanism should grab hold of the filament and slowly pull it through the extruder. The printer should begin extruding material and printing your part. Once you have confirmed that the printer is functioning, cancel the print. Remove the filament cartridge in the same way you did at the beginning. Clip the top back on, ensuring the filament isn't in the way of any of the clips and the plastic piece you held throughout the process is in the same place as it was at the beginning. If you are worried that you will break your printer at any time during the process, do not hesitate to contact the Cubify support team at the email cubifysupport at 3dsystems.com. Good luck and happy printing!